Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to today's live stream. Welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're watching me live right now on my Twitch channel, I want to say hi, how are you doing? And thank you for watching. Thank you for taking the time out of your busy days to uh, call past and watch me stream this brand new release game. But if you couldn't make it to today's live stream and you're watching this back on my YouTube channel, once again, hi, how's your dog? And thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I really do appreciate it. Thank you in advance. Come visit me over on Twitch, Twitter, and YouTube. That's Marble A M A R B R O L A Y. Why not? Now, this stream is proudly sponsored by, supported by, and supplied by the amazing people at East Asia Soft. EastAsiaSoft.com. Check them out. This game is called Caddy. And let me tell you what it's about before we dive in and in and start playing it. Okay, where are we? Here we go. Prance with position in a fiercely feline style as you journey through an old school action platform adventure. Get ready for platforming action of a retro kind as you take the role of a nimble kitten named Caddy. Run, jump, hop from a wall to wall. Crouch, prance and swipe at enemies as you make your way through side-scrolling pixel art, art, art stages with feline position. Inspired by gene classics of the 80s, Caddy is presented in a minimalistic black and white style and fluid 2D animation. There are a hundred. That's one zero zero, not 99, not 101, not 106, or not even 110, but a hundred levels to explore. All set in a nostalgic 8 bit soundtrack. Challenge with a ramp up your progress, gradually in introducing new enemies and stage mechanics. Do you have the skills to help Caddy reach the end? Probably not. So the game features Explore 100 platforming stages of a nimble feline. Run, jump, hop between walls, crouch and prance with precision controls. Avoid spikes and navigate maze-like corridors. Survive by swiping enemy bats, skeletons, snakes and more with your little with your little claws. Enjoy retro anesthetics and nostalgic 8-bit soundtrack. Now it's a single player game. Uh, Gene is a platformer action adventure puzzle. The game just got released today, which is the 7th of August, 2024. Support a language in English and Portuguese. Uh, whoops, once again, the amazing publisher is East Asia Soft. Uh, developer of the game is Virgu, Virgu, I can't pronounce the name, sorry, but you know who you are. Big shout out to them. V-E-R-G-I-U Games. Uh, it's available for the Nintendo Switch, the PS4, the PS5, the Xbox One, Xbox Series S and X. Uh, today, guys, I'm playing on the PlayStation 5. Let's check out the credits. There's the credits. Virgu. I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm not too sure, but I do apologise for saying it wrong. Uh, options. There's the options. Not much to see there. And let's play it. Okay, so these normally these first couple of stages are tutorial stages. They're pretty simple. Got no double jump. Uh, we're going to get across here. Okay, so you can use the joystick or the you know thumbstick. What do you want to call it? Joystick or the D-pad. Okay, I'm just gonna... This is gonna take a while. There we go. And the bang, we made it. Okay, so that was level one done. Uh, we can just jump down here like this. Up. Level two done. So it basically gives you the, um, you know, the feel of the game. You need to get a double jump going. That's what we need. Okay, so there's spikes there. How the hell are I going to... Oh, I didn't see the bridge. I just kept them going. Okay, so there. Oh, I knew I was going to get caught that last one. So we can wall slide like that. Oh, I thought I was going to get caught again. Okay, so we get a trophy. Our first trophy called Platformer 1. Okay, so this is swiping. We're gonna swap these little slugs. Let's take you, sluggy. Take you. Take my Mike Tyson poor. I'm not too confident in their um the ability to swipe. That's a big jump. Okay, that's pretty cool. It works pretty. The hit can the hit uh. Hit collision detection there is a bit way off, to be honest. But I don't, look, I'm not going to complain. We don't want to be too hard. So we, what, if it's too hard, 
then we're in trouble. Oh, this is gonna be a big jump. Wait for him, wait for him. Oh, he's jumped! He just jumped on my head! Oh, I didn't react in time there. What am I doing? Did we all see what just happened? I didn't expect him to jump. He got my ass given to me, didn't we? Oh, wow. Did not expect him to jump. Oh, he's going to do it again. No, he's not. Like, I went for the swing, and he's just... Oh, hold on. Sorry, guys. I just... I wasn't even paying attention to where I was. Um, I went for the swing, and he jumped, and I got smacked. Absolutely smacked by him. What's that? Oh, right, checkpoint. Does that mean the stage is kind of hard, then? What's over here? Nothing. Yeah, this is. I don't know what we're going to checkpoint in this stage. Maybe because all of a sudden they start jumping. I can never trophy called platformer two. Uh, I can never because the spring's gone here. Oh, I'm not going to make this. Okay. Oh, almost died. <laughs> oh man, I saved myself then, but then I died. Oh, oh. Aye, aye. Oh man. Oh, spikies. Because being black and white, or monochrome, what do you want to call it these days? It's black and white. Um, you got to figure out. You got to look for everything, don't you? Because oh, like that. That was stupid then. But sometimes you don't see things. You just gotta look for shapes that can hurt you. It's not a bad little game, to be honest. I kind of like it. Caddy, it's called. And once again, it's... Okay, so this got killed by a uh, mushroom. Thank God for the... I was gonna say, what's the point of these... Um... Oh, yeah, what's the point of these uh, checkpoints? But that one, that something saved my life. Okay, so I kind of didn't work that way. Okay, so that didn't work again. I need to take my time here. Oh, I'm back. Oh, that's one way of getting rid of him. Snakes come after you. I didn't realize. Oh, oh. Yeah, they definitely come after you there. It was, it was tricky. Oh, man. Okay, so I've got to jump. Hey, is it raining outside? Sorry, guys, let's check if it's raining. Okay, died. No idea what I was doing then. Take that. I got washing on the line, so I go over work, did a lot of washing, put it on, decided I'm going to stream this game, and now I think it's just going to rain. Uh, trophy earned, platformer 3. Man, they're not getting, they're not getting any difficult there, are they? They, just keep, they could have named it something else. They could have named it something else. Ho oh, ho ho! Ah, oh, the bat. I hate bats in games. Except for Batman, of course. Bats in games suck. I wonder if I could... Hunk through this guy in the air. Nah, I can't. You, you, you probably can. I think it's probably best if I just wait. Nah, it's not waiting enough. Level 13 it is, guys. Level 13. Let's see if there's bats. Okay, is he gonna come? I'm just gonna try to jump that whole thing. Okay, checkpoint, which is great. Okay, the bats. What's he doing? Yeah, I knew I wasn't going to make that jump. You know, I was biting off too much so that I could chew then. This, this cat's definitely not Garfield. 
Oh! Oh! Almost lost it! <laughs> oh, that would have been bad. Oh! What the hell? Pine cone! Well. Oh! Okay, so. Okay, let's just not do that. I'm playing with a D pad now. Oh, I didn't even touch it. <laughs> okay, we're gonna we're just not gonna be able to do this. Okay. Okay, D pad it up. Like I could probably Okay, yep. Ah, oh, stupid mushroom house. Okay, we can just run. Is this stuff gonna fall if I land it too long? Yeah, but it is. Oh, I got too ahead of myself. That sucked. I wonder if I can run across. You can. Oh, yeah, but your jump's a little bit too big sometimes then. Oh, this could be tricky. Okay, so we're going to go up here. No, I'm not even going to risk. There we go. What stage are we on? Ah, uh, there we go, guys. Trophy unit, platformer 4, uh, level 17. Please. Oh! Oh, wow. What happened then? I didn't even touch him. Okay, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Hmm, interesting. Oh! Okay, we did it! I panicked, but we did it. Woo! Okay, we're gonna time this well. Seems that uh, we're gonna watch out that pine cone coming down on our heads as well. Oh yeah, baby. That's the stuff. Oh, that wasn't the stuff. How the hell do we make that? Okay, that's a tricky one because I don't know. This game hasn't got double jump. It kind of really needs to have a double jump. I like games like this that have double jump. It makes things a lot easier. There we go. Oh, okay. Should be able to make this now. Shouldn't have to panic too much here. And oh, what the hell? It's like jump, it's like jump. Is it raining? It's like jump didn't work. This way, guys, I'm just going outside. Not outside, looking at the window. So, no, it's not raining yet. Like, I should have made that then. And it's like that jump button just did not function. Or my thumb didn't function. One of the two. It's probably my thumb. Okay. Now, I'm not even going to say I'm going to make this this time. But I should make it. There we go. I wouldn't have jumped first. Okay, we're going to get to level 20. At least, at least level 20. Now remember it's 100, 100 stages. Oh, we've got goblins in this and they're going to be fast. Uh, remember, 100 levels of this stuff. Okay, tricky. Oh, we had to be quick then, didn't we? Oh, shit. No way, slime ball. Okay, we're just going to make sure... There we go, level 20, done. Okay, back to main menu, guys. There we go, Catty, brought to us today by the amazing people at East Asia Soft, eastasiasoft.com. Check them out, there's the credits again for these hardworking people that made the game, published the game, everything like that. What do we think about it? What do we think about Catty on the Marble Lay Mini Indie Game Review? Well, it's the visualization of it, it's cool. It's pixelated, 8-bit. Uh, in black and white, so I like the way it looks being a retro gamer. I like retro games I was got brought up with these type of games when I was young so in the 80s. I uh, like the way it looks uh, It's not gonna be for everyone. It's also kind of like um, it's a platforming game It's not a puzzle game, but it's a platforming challenging game over a hundred levels. We did 20 of them uh, So it's gonna get difficulter It goes it gets it gets harder harder harder. It gets easy easy harder 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 and then it gets easy easy harder harder. When they introduce something new to the game 
um, like a new, like these goblins. The first stage is a little bit easy, then it gets, gradually gets harder, then it'll introduce something else to the game, and start off easy again, and get harder and harder. Um, I could see like up to, you know, the higher levels is gonna be a bit of a, maybe a bit of a nightmare, but I overall like what, the way the game looks. Uh, soundtrack in the background, it's a nostalgic, pixelated, um, you know, retro soundtrack, which matches the game down to the T. Uh, gameplay wise, I played today in the PlayStation 5. No bugs, no glitches. Everything seemed to um, work well. Uh, jumping was pretty precision. Um, the, the, the clawing was a little bit off. Uh, you don't need to be exactly, you don't need to exactly hit the, hit the enemy, but that, which is good, it adds to the gameplay. If it was too, too uh, realistic, uh, it'd make the game even harder. So we wouldn't want that. We want, it's, the way it plays out is perfectly fine right now. Um, on the Marvel Ace Mini Indie Game Review, uh, Caddy, I'm gonna give this game a seven out of 10. I quite liked it. If you're into these type of games, Man, this game just came out right now, today, the 7th of August 2024, for the PlayStation, Xbox, Nintendo consoles. Go pick it up. It's a good game. Really, really good game. Big shout out again for East Asia Soft for sending me this game. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, Mr. Too Soon, welcome to the stream. I'm going well, thank you for asking. And thank you for calling past. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, what else I was saying? Uh, everyone that called past my live stream today watched me live on uh, Twitch, I want to say thank you. Uh, if you're watching this back on my YouTube channel, please hit the like button, subscribe to my YouTube channel. I really do appreciate it. Thank you in advance. Um, make sure you take care of yourselves and ones you love. Don't forget to feed your pets. Remember, the name's Marble Lee. Say hi to your dog for me. Thank you for watching and bye for now.